right, all right, all right. This is Intuitive Empress with messages from your person for the sign of Capricorn. And so I am going to start out by saying thank you, thank you, thank you so much to my subscribers. You have been marvelous, especially the sign of Capricorn. You were one of my top people for last month which earned you a bonus reading. So, I will say if you are a new subscriber, thank you for entrusting me. Love, 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 love to all my subscribers, especially my older subscribers who showed up and showed out with this. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe. Hit that bell notification so you know when the next reading is coming out, you will be notified. Like, thumbs up, comment. If the message resonates to you, let me know. Let me know your story. It'll definitely encourage me. And without any further ado, here we go. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels of God, Most High God, come into this reading. And provide messages for Capricorn's person. No other spirits are welcome. And I had a whole bunch fall out. And there was too many to take. But I did have two fall out. So, it says you deserve so much more than I was able to give at the time. Allow this love to unfold perfectly. Any other messages? Holy Spirit. Divine protection has been coming out a lot lately. Divine protection. Because people are needing protection. Because there's a lot of players out there. Wannabe players. That things don't work out and then they want to come back. Stop talking to that person. Hmm. All right. Okay, we have a couple of messages. I'm ready to follow you anywhere. Extremely petty. Where were you last night? Summer wedding. All right, I'm going to stop right here. All right, so this is what I'm getting. You need a divine protection and need divine protection because this person is extremely petty. They're saying you deserve much more than what they were able to give you at the time. So I feel like they left and now they're making excuses saying that you deserve better. But now they can do you better than they did before to allow this love to unfold perfectly. They want you to stop talking to who you're with, who you who they think you're dealing with or who you are dealing with. Now they're saying they're willing to follow you anywhere. They want to marry you and say, let's have a summer wedding. And they're asking you, where you were, were you last night? So all of this is stemming from jealousy because you have moved on after they decided that they didn't want you anymore. And this person is, is kind of psychotic. That's why you need divine protection. This person is thinking about morning sex with you. Or they think that you had morning sex because they said, where were you last night? So this person is kind of stalking you because they know that you were out and they think that you're having sex with someone else and had morning sex with someone else. And you may have, but why does it matter? Because you're not with that person. Let me hold you. You deserve so much. I have so much desire for you. So now this person has desire for you. I want you. They want you because you were with someone else. Your pictures make me horny. I don't like this.
it's a reason. I, I feel like I feel like I'm gonna rush through this message. That's how crazy this energy is, and it's making me uncomfortable. I'm not sure how I'm not sure I fully express just how much you mean to me. My life would be nothing without you. I wish I could be honest with you. I still believe that this person is just saying that because you're with someone else. I feel some real jealous, stalkerish, dangerous energy. I really do. But this person left you, Capricorn. It's silly of me to want you so badly and yet try to keep it hidden and concealed. I love you unconditionally. Leaving something old to die, I want something new. We need to talk. See... talk to this person Capricorn so I feel like this person is dangerous I feel like they've been following you and stalking you after they left you and whatever they had didn't work out or and or they're still with that person and see that you're with someone else and you've moved on and they don't want you to be with anyone else either way that's some crazy energy and they're asking, do you think of me? I don't like that energy. I'm going to get some letters for you because I, I, I think, I, I just, I, I don't know. I think this person is dangerous. I, I mean, really, I'm concerned. Uh, so I'm going to try to see if I can get some letters for you as well as some charms messages today I choose joy choose joy Capricorn this situation is not a joyous experience you plus me equals love I think this is the person you may be seeing not the person that's given this message, the person that says stop seeing that person or stop talking to that person. I think this is that person that you're talking to. Surprise. I think your person, the person in this message is going to try to surprise you with a visit, a phone call, a message. You're stronger than you think. I'm getting a sense. I, I really feel like you had to run away from this person. Whoever this is. It's not for everybody. But I'm really getting a sense. That you had to run away. From this person. I'm really getting that sense. But there is hope. Because you are divinely protected. It came up in, in the thing. It came up in the reading. It's better to hope than despair. Don't despair over this person because you are divinely protected. But use wisdom. Do not let this person back into your life. Do not meet this person. Do not talk to this person. You know who this is for. Whoever this is. You know. I feel it. Don't lose hope. You never know what tomorrow may bring. Or maybe you need to get away from this person. Because this energy is so disturbing that even if you're with this person, you could be out with a co-worker, um, just a friend, a cousin, or they could have saw you in a restaurant talking to your boss or something. But whatever it is, is triggering something in this person that they think you're with someone else. And 
I feel like this is very specific for a specific person. You're going to know who this is for. The whole message wasn't, but I'm feeling it. Do not let this person back into your life. I see lovebirds. Lovebirds, there's new love. Maybe this person you were with or somebody else. This person that your ex-person saw you with. I just really don't feel good about that. There's a gear here. You know gears make things go. Gears are in a lot of machinery. But if that gear gets stuck, guess what? The machinery gets stuck. It could go blow up or explode. I feel like this person is about to explode. I'm just going to see if I can find some names in here. I, I, I really don't feel like going through all the letters. I just feel like this message, man. I, I never thought that I would feel like this, but I came into this to uh, help someone. I see the word panda. I don't know if you like panda bears. I don't know if you saw panda bears recently on TV at the zoo. I don't know if it's that restaurant, Panda Express, if you're going there. If you met this person there, the new person, the old person, did they see you at Panda Express? Um, looking at the letters here. All right, so I'm just going to go to the letters real quick. I'm not going to hold them up. I see P-R-M-U-T-R-U-D-G-N-W-S-L-H-E-S-Q-Z. Another K. J. M. Another Q, a Y. Try to see if you can get these letters and see these letters here. I don't think so because they're so small, which is why I normally hold them up to the camera. And maybe you can enlarge your screen. These are letters anywhere within your person's name. Or your name. I really don't like that feeling. So I'm going to try to give you as much encouragement and warning as possible. You'll know if any of these letters fit the name of that person. I want you to be protected. I'm going to be praying, sending protection, energy your way. I think I'm going to burn my sage for you. Because 
I don't like this energy. I don't. And a lot of letters came out. As you can see. Hopefully, you can make your screen big to see those letters. Um, all right, I'm going to let you go, Capricorn. Um, but if this message resonated, please do what you need to do. Especially for this specific person that this message came into. Please take care of yourself. Please do what you need to do. You are divinely protected, but please use some wisdom and caution. Do not put yourself in a dangerous situation. Okay? I'll see you next time.